All right, absolutely. This is a force to be reckoned with, especially today. Just such a dominant force as we are seeing right here. But let's see how he could do against the mighty Delta Force. Yeah. Has been champion at Fusion before. Uh, very close on the times we've uh, commentated. Yeah. yeah. Now it's uh, Mateo Monday, by the way. <laughs> yeah, it is Mateo Monday. He didn't show up, unfortunately, but hey, man, make sure you celebrate Mateo Monday. Can you but, really say it's Mateo Monday if Mateo isn't here, though? I don't know, man. Listen, it might be it might be Lum Luminous Monday, Held Force Monday. We'll, we'll have to see. You know yeah, I mean? we're, we're going to have to see who takes it this Monday, to be honest. Yeah. Delta Force is the defending champion of Fusion, winning in the offline Fusion uh, with no stream, beating uh, WebJP oh, and you're, Hayes. Oh, you're right. I forgot about that. Yeah. Yeah. Actually, I lied. He didn't beat WebJP. WebJP didn't. Play him in bracket. It was a uh, <laughs> he beat Sola and Hayes. My bad, my bad right. guys. Yeah, but it's, it's okay. I think Webb went only core in that bracket. But yeah, he did. He still, still got third though. Yeah, you know what I mean that's still impressive regardless. And what's impressive is going to be this set right now. Oh, for sure. We're starting off on PS2 as well. Yeah, and listen, it's been a while since these players have played. And when I say a while, I mean it's been over a year since these two players have matched up against each other in bracket. Really? What tournament was Last it? time, it was Fusion number 163, over 50 Fusions ago. Wow, a, a July, long... July 10th, 2023. Wow, a long due run back, over a year in the making. Yep, and in that one, Luminous was actually able to get his first win over Delta Force, winning 2-0. Ooh, let's so. see if he can continue a win streak today. Yeah. Now, I'm not really sure what to think of this matchup. What do you think about this? I'm going to be honest, I don't know either. <laughs> Listen, if I had to guess, I feel like Greninja does overwhelm with a lot of his moves, has a, a lot of quick moves that Link might struggle to deal with, but at the same time, Link does have good out of shield. Yeah. He does have some tricky neutral and some solid buttons himself. So let's see how this set goes. So far, yeah. um, Delta Force being able to uh, take a lot of damage. Taking things slow, doesn't want to over approach knowing how good Greninja's advantage can be in this matchup. Yeah, no, I, I'm i going to be honest. When it comes to this matchup, I'm going to just assume you're correct because I have <laughs> never seen this matchup at a high level. If I had a dollar for every time I've seen this matchup, I would be very broke so as a famous content creator once said it is just a theory a game theory <laughs> it's all theory crafting i gotta say but i mean so far i mean delta force doing a good job of taking advantage of the space that ps2 provides to sort of establish that you can't mess with me zone that he likes to establish yeah he probably can't get as much ledge traps as he's comfortable with. Yeah. However, he can establish the neutral with his tricky setups and solid aerials to contest as well. So, yeah, Delta Force has to play a lot more center stage than he normally does because ledge trapping is hard against Greninja when you have like a million options and a huge jump. I mean, right there, just avoids the ledge trap and gets that successful near the fair. But yeah, oh, almost got the ledge trump, but. Good stuff on Delta Force for normal grabbing on time. Yeah, double parry as well right there. We're seeing some high level gameplay right here, but I think the main thing that's really benefiting Delta Force is the longevity and survivability. He's holding down center stage, giving Luminous a really hard time in securing this first stock. Absolutely. That is one of the unfortunate problems of Greninja. Ooh. Though he does have kill confirms, it is hard to set them up. Oh my, <laughs> what, well, is, what is he doing? <laughs> well, let's, let's hope that taunt doesn't cost Luminous as we saw yeah. there. Kind of hard to notice uh, Greninja's taunts, to be honest. Unless it's the you got very one. You got very low key taunts, I gotta say. Yeah, on the low, mm -hmm. I definitely agree. Some some slight. Yeah, some slight. <laughs> Here we but go. But something though. that's not slight right now is this ledge trapping that is going on, almost killing uh, Luminous right there if he wasn't careful. Yeah, Luminous is still doing a very good job of escaping these ledge traps. I know for the most part, like, again, Delta Force, his specialty is just trapping at the ledge and making you feel like it's impossible to get off. But because of Greninja's movement options, being such a high jumper, having all of these special moves to change his movement, he's kind of able to get off ledge pretty efficiently. Yeah, for sure. But like, Not at, there, though. Yeah, as, <laughs> as you say that, he might have high jumps, but not high enough to avoid that bomb right there gonna be on his last stock of game one right now 
But honestly, he is keeping it pretty competitive, all things considered. Yeah, when he's able to effectively get in and get past these projectiles, he's able to put in a lot of damage. It just comes down to, can you secure that stock? And he's kind of had trouble, but he still has a very Ooh. close percentage and is able to get a good confirm there. Delta Force kind of looking back like, what was that? Yeah, I was like, what? That hit? <laughs> That's like a me reaction right there. <laughs> for sure, for sure. But as I say that, now stuck at this ledge, the classic Delta Force. But as I say that, oh, here get we the go back here. Oh, this tried to risk it all right there. I don't blame him. That probably would have killed right there, mm -hmm. even with the heavy weight of uh, Link. Bit of a risky side be almost costing him his stock right there. Yeah, Luminous getting a little bit too confident almost, getting a little bit frisky with some of these options. Gotta stay disciplined, even if you're trying to make a comeback. Yeah, and he's at such a high percentage, I mean. Delta Force sneezes at him, he might get KO'd. Yeah, one there, one F yeah. or one up B. That well, right there, that's the Delta Force. That is the that is the classic certified Delta Force right there. And that's what I was talking about, the ledge trapping. That's the main thing that we've noticed throughout the sets we commentate with him that's so good about him. Yeah, even being one of the most evasive characters in the game, Greninja cannot escape the Delta Force classic ledge trap. Yeah, let's see here, look at that. Oh. Avoiding the boomerang and being able to punish him right there. Great stuff, but not good enough to be able to take this just yet. But let's see if uh, Luminous can adapt this game, too. Yeah, I mean, it's going to be interesting. You definitely don't want to fall for that trap again. I feel like everyone at some point has fallen for that against Delta Force. The classic just... You, you forget that that bomb still has that very active hitbox. So yeah, that's the thing. It, feel, it feels safe in the moment to... Oh, now I could get up, but nope. Got to be careful of even the slightest bounce. Exactly. But the hang into this ball. game two. We're going. We're straight going to battle battlefield. Field. All right. Um, probably a comfort pick. I feel like it's good for both characters. Greninja with his combo extensions, yeah. and Link with his setups, and also I feel like he could kind of juggle as well with like his long-lasting up air. Yeah, you probably want to kill off the top with an up air. I would imagine. If you are Greninja, same thing goes with the Delta Force Stone Link. I mean, that lingering up air is very powerful. And I mean, you have to be a bit careful, but I do like this counterfeit. Definitely a very strong Greninja stage. Absolutely. Trying to sneak in a side B, but not sneaky enough for this ninja, right? Whoa. Uh, hello? Um, Excuse me? Yeah, he's gonna have to work on the ninja work right there. <laughs> He's gonna have to go back to class. Fell asleep on the wheel? Sensei's a little disappointed. I but know, man. As we see here. Ninjas never sleep, man. Delta Force just taking advantage of that unfortunate SD. Oh, I fought for a second. <laughs> almost almost a second one. Another one? Nah. No. Not this time. But we are gonna see some more combos come off. But I mean, Delta Force isn't falling for any of the tips and tricks. Absolutely. It's just looking kind of rough and unfortunate. A character that already struggles to kill stock down so let's see if luminous can do something the bomb being able to break through yeah now i've seen you know luminous make some big comebacks but delta force playing as sharp as he is is not gonna let that kind of thing slide for free yeah for sure all right be able oh, to go back to ledge but for how long is he going to be able to not very long already back at the ledge position once again oh and that that bomb man <laughs> that bomb so scary the way he's able to trap people so efficiently i know man just that tiny little grenade is enough to just one the absolute works just that little tap is enough just the stun leading into different attacks is crazy for sure the little the littlest of dribbles being able to confirm into mm -hmm. whatever your imagination feels like and especially the bomb recovery is being able to help <laughs> oh okay no bomb today no yeah, bomb, no bomb. Today. normally you got those build-a-bear combos but i mean listen luminous was taking down that bear with that stock i like what he tried to do with the upbeat to push him off stage but not going to be able to push him far enough but as i say that Putting him in the lead trap position. Hold this on. could be something big. All okay, right. he's still going. Still got him at the ledge. Aww. And it's gone. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> 12 seconds. New record. There we go, though. I mean, oh. oh, oh. <laughs> no, he's going to be fine. Greninja has a high enough recovery, but I'm yeah. so surprised that didn't hit right there. Just being able to get a ledge right on time. This feels like your life, and... life kind of flashes before your eyes. And Speaking of which, that was the last he saw. A solid two stock. On yeah. uh, both games, right? Another quick 2-0 we see yeah. here in winners finals. Just decisive match after decisive match, even in losers bracket as well. Beast 
getting Gabo G 2-0 and Pawn Master being Bobby Fail 2-0. Like, it's been nothing but decisive matches. So, these these winners they come around to play. Yeah. <laughs> They're is... popping out and showing players as per yeah, usual. Exactly. I just realized that uh, Luminous was like muting out the camera at the beginning of the oh, set. Oh really? I didn't even notice. I didn't even. Peep. Shout out to shout out to Tony, man. But he's gonna be, he's gonna have to play Beast and no, uh, yeah. lose his quarters, which is not ideal. Yeah, me me and Tony actually did uh, push ups together on uh oh for real yeah my TikTok oh page. yeah yeah hey y'all y'all uh, y'all better, better on follow crow dog on TikTok man that's the real motivation yeah I'll be waking up early mornings and, and, I watch I watch that crow dog uh <laughs> that that daily push up video I feel like I can do <laughs> anything bro I no, feel unstoppable the funny thing was we did push ups right before uh the Omic Bob set and I oh, believe really? that's what gave him the push up <laughs> power up <laughs> you gave him, <laughs> you gave him the buff that's crazy nah yeah today we did about. 29 today, you know, some some slight. Damn, that, that, that's pretty nice. That's pretty nice. Listen, I remember that one time I did the, <laughs> I was doing the push-ups with you. Oh yeah. I, I don't know how many I did. I probably did like 20, and I, yeah, I, I did 20 did. half push-ups, and I was like lying on the floor gassed. <laughs> I'm not built for this. Nah, it's definitely something that takes training and work, just like these hard players got to put in the work mm -hmm. in order to get through the losers bracket. Yeah, Delta Force has been making quick work out of a lot of these opponents so far. Again, in a bracket defined by upsets, it feels like Delta Force has been playing so sharply today. And I mean, it makes complete sense that him and Pharaoh would be facing off in winner's finals. Sure, I'm very excited to see that set whenever it pops up.